Hello everyone. Welcome to UIAS. Let's discuss today's prelims topics. Question 1 with reference to DNA vaccine, consider the following statements. 1. AM DNA vaccine is a type of vaccine that transfects a specific antigen coding DNA sequence into the cells of an organism as a mechanism to induce an immune response. 2. DNA vaccines work by injecting genetically engineered plasmid containing the DNA sequence encoding the antigens against which an immune response is sought, so the cells directly produce the antigen, thus causing a protective immunological response. 3. The world's first DNA vaccine ZYCOVD, developed by Ahmedabad-based pharmaceutical firm Zydus Cadilla, was approved in 2021 for emergency use against COVID-19. Which of the following given above is are correct? A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 1, 2 and 3. D. 2 only. The answer is C. Question to consider the following statements about Foreign Contribution Regulation Act, FCRA. 1. FCRA was enacted during the emergency in 1976 amid apprehensions that foreign powers were interfering in India's affairs by pumping money into the country through independent organizations. To the law sought to regulate foreign donations to individuals and associations so that they functioned in a manner consistent with the values of a sovereign democratic republic. 3D Act allows the receipt of foreign funds by candidates for elections, journalists, or newspaper and media broadcast companies. Which of the following given above is our correct? A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 only. C. 1, 2, and 3. D. 2 and 3 only. The answer is A. The Act prohibits the receipt of foreign funds by candidates for elections, journalists or newspaper and media broadcast companies, judges and government servants, members of the legislature and political parties or their office bearers, and organizations of a political nature. FCRA requires every person or NGO seeking to receive foreign donations to be I. Registered under the Act. 2. To open a bank account for the receipt of foreign funds in the State Bank of India, Delhi, and 3. To utilize those funds only for the purpose for which they have been received and as stipulated in the Act. They are also required to file annual returns and they must not transfer the funds to another NGO. Question 3. Consider the following statements about NASA's Imaging X-ray Polarimetry Explorer, IXPE. 1. IXPE is a collaboration between NASA and the European Space Agency with partners and science collaborators in 12 countries. 2. IXPE is the first satellite dedicated to measuring the polarization of X-rays from a variety of cosmic sources, such as black holes and neutron stars. 3. IXPE revealed the shape and orientation of hot matter around a black hole. Which of the following given above is are correct? A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 1, 2 only and 3. D. 2 and 3 only. Answer is D. IXPE is a collaboration between NASA and the Italian Space Agency with partners and science collaborators in 12 countries. Question 4 with reference to the recent constitution bench of the Supreme Court verdict on the appointment of Chief Election Commissioner, CEC, and Election Commissioners, ECs, consider the following statements. 1. The appointments should be made by the President of India based on advice from a committee comprising the Prime Minister, the Leader of the Opposition in the Lok Sabha, and the Chief Justice of India. 2. The Constitution of India mandates the ECI with the superintendence, direction, and control of the preparation of the electoral rolls for, and the conduct of, all elections to Parliament state legislatures as well as President and Vice President. 3. They have a tenure of 4 years, 
or up to the age of 65 years, whichever is earlier. Which of the following given above is our correct? A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 1, 2 and 3 D. 2 and 3 only Answer is A. They have a tenure of 6 years or up to the age of 65 years, whichever is earlier. Question 5. Consider the following statements about monoamniotic monochorionic, momo or monomono twins. 1. In a momo pregnancy, the twins are known to share the same placenta, but they have a different amniotic sac, fluid and umbilical cords. 2. AM mother gives birth to momo twins when a single fertilized ovum or egg leads to identical twins and these twins share the same placenta and amniotic sac. 3. Ultrasound is the only way to detect monoamniotic monochorionic twins before birth. Which of the following given above is our correct? A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 1, 2 and 3 D. 2 and 3 only Answer is D. In a momo pregnancy, the twins are known to share the same placenta, amniotic sac and fluid, but they have different umbilical cords. Question 6. Consider the following statements about World Wildlife Day, WWD. First March 3rd is known as World Wildlife Day, WWD, marked annually to draw attention to issues of conservation of flora and fauna. To this year, the theme is Partnerships for Lifeline Conservation. 3. Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora sites was signed in 1973 on this day. Which of the following given above is our correct? A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 1, 2 and 3 D. 2 and 3 only Answer is B. This year, the theme is Partnerships for Wildlife Conservation. In 2013, the United Nations General Assembly, UNGAR, proclaimed 3rd March as the UN World Wildlife Day to celebrate and raise awareness of protecting the world's wild animals and plants. This was as the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora sites was signed in 1973 on this day. Question 7. Consider the following statements about the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora sites. One sites is an international agreement between governments. Two, its aim is to ensure that international trade in specimens of wild animals and plants does not threaten the survival of the species. Three sites is considered a landmark agreement on conservation that focuses on ensuring the sustainability of endangered species. Which of the following given above is our correct? A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 1, 2 and 3 D. 2 only The answer is C. 3rd March marks the 50th anniversary of CITES establishment. CITES is considered a landmark agreement on conservation that focuses on ensuring the sustainability of endangered species. The CITES Secretariat is administered by UNEP, the United Nations Environment Programme, and is located in Geneva, Switzerland. The Conference of the Parties to Sites is the supreme consensus-based decision-making body of the Convention and comprises all its parties. Question 8. Consider the following statements about Porter Price. 1. The Union Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, MOHFW, has received the Porter Prize 2003. 2. Porter Prize is named after Michael E. Porter, an economist, researcher, author, advisor, speaker, and teacher. 3. The prize recognizes the strategy followed by the Government of India in managing COVID-19 and the approach and involvement of various stakeholders, 
especially the involvement of ASHA workers in the industry to create PPE kits. Which of the following given above is our correct? A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 1, 2 and 3 D. 2 and 3 only The answer is C. Porter Prize is named after US citizen Michael E. Porter, an economist, researcher, author, advisor, speaker and teacher. He has brought economic theory and strategy concepts to bear on many of the most challenging problems facing corporations, economies, and societies, including market competition and company strategy, economic development, environment, and healthcare. His research has received numerous awards, and he is the most cited scholar today in economics and business. Thank you, everyone. Do subscribe to this channel. Use code SPLIVE to join an academy.